from ET up next. Go ahead, Lauren. Zendaya, so many congratulations. I don't know if you could see the faces of your fellow nominees, but you know, Jennifer Aniston's jaw dropped when you won. She was cheering and screaming for you. Tell me how that feels to have all of those icons cheering for you and you being the youngest ever to win here. Uh, it, oh gosh, it means uh, means so much to me. I think uh, every single you know woman in that category, I obviously admire immensely, and and you know their work and and everything they continue to do. Um, and so just to be, I think mentioned within the category at all um, was something. And then just to have their support and having them smile and wave at me and stuff like that uh, meant a lot to me. So um, that support really, you know, really filled my heart, I guess you could say. And so, and you being the youngest ever to win, tell me how that feels. You said you almost cried. <laughs> yeah. I, um, I, I, you know, for things like, I don't usually cry and, and I, I definitely, you know, it, it started. Uh, it started getting. I got through it without um, letting it take over completely. But um, but yeah, no, I'm, it's obviously a very emotional moment, and um, uh, yeah, I uh, still can't believe it myself. So it's pretty pretty crazy. Congratulations, and you look gorgeous. The second outfit. Oh wow! Thank you. Great. Thank you so much, <laughs> Thank Lauren. Thank you very much. <laughs> Up next, we've got Andrew from Dish Nation. Go ahead, Andrew. I'm just unmuting myself. Um, first of all, Zendaya, congratulations. Thank you. Um, I, I guess I, I want to ask you what it was like, because watching you, I just experienced so much happiness, seeing how happy you guys were in that room. And this year has yeah. been filled with so much turmoil. So I guess I want to know was, what is it like experiencing so much joy in a year filled with so much pain? Um, oh, that's a big question. Um, I mean, I'm just, I'm just grateful for moments like this moments where we can have joy and we can, um, wrap our arms around our loved ones and, and tell each other, we love, we love each other and we're proud of each other. I think it's moments like this that we really have to, um, all hold on to and, and cherish. And, um, so I'm, I'm, I'm just grateful that, you know, obviously my whole family who's now standing off to the side and trying to be quiet, um, <laughs> um, is all here to celebrate with me, um, and be here. I, I definitely felt, you know, this like wrapping of love around me as, um, as I was sitting here. So, um, yeah, I just, just trying to take, take it all in and, and be grateful for all the, all the moments that you, that we do have, um, of, of joy and happiness, you know? Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. And thank you, Andrew. Next up, we've got Tanya from The Root. Tanya, go ahead. Hi, Zadea. Congratulations. Hi. Thank you. Very well deserved. Um, I Thanks actually wanted so much. to. Absolutely. I wanted to talk to you about uh, and wanted you to speak to the importance of this show that showcases a black girl who, who gets to mess up and who gets to be a fully realized person, especially it's an Emmy winning mm -hmm. show. <laughs> um, you know, it, it, it's extremely important. I think Rue to me, what's so special about her character is that she is um, a full whole human being and she's layered and she's, um, and she's complicated. And I think as the show goes on, you know, um, we're also able to empathize uh, with addiction and what that looks like um, and what that does to a family and be able to understand and, and still root for, for Rue. We understand what's going on through her head. We understand how she views the world and, and how she views um, everything that happens to her. And we're able to empathize with her as a character, which I think is a beautiful thing. Um, and so for me, uh, I've always been very grateful for all the people who feel that they connect to Rue. Um, or feel that through the show, they've been able to put or attach words or find themselves within um, a scene or a moment um, where they otherwise felt maybe alone or felt like maybe they were the only persons dealing with or having those thoughts or, um, you know, just to have that clarity or have that feeling that maybe there is other people that feel what I feel, I think is huge and it's very important. And um, and yeah, I, I'm, I'm very grateful to, to have been continue to be brew, you know, she, she's very, very important to me and I, I care about her deeply. So 